Hi there! Welcome to this edition of State of the Cow. I'm Bunny Williams of Undead Cow Studios, and this is... Jeannie of Undead Cow Studios. <sighs> so the first thing I would really like to say is, fuck YouTube, okay? No, really. Fuck YouTube. You know, I can't add contacts anymore. Uh, I, I'm lucky if I'm able to subscribe to one person a day. Fuck that. Uh... But I am going to try to see what I can do about getting some kind of content up every week. Probably usually, probably, it'll probably be like be on Thursdays. I'm thinking, you know, anything. State of the Cow, or a, a video viscosity, or any kind of promo or thing like that. I can totally get up together just to get something out there. So these State of the Cows are really going to, you know, I wanted that to be monthly. That's just not going to happen. Well, for one thing, you had your computer was down. But even just on a regular basis, to sit down and try to do a state of the cow every month, that might be just a little much. Because um, there's really a lot going on here lately. Uh, the script for It's Him is finished. The first draft is finished. It's Him. It's Him, which will probably be renamed to My Little Pony. Not My Little Pony, so stop what you're doing. I'm not that kind of playmate. <laughs> Uh, that's th that's uh, for the sequel. Uh, 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 I took an older script of mine off the shelf that's live from KTLZ, which is a, is a zombie story, and I did another full rewrite on that, and that one's really uh, a good story. Um, that one's a lot of fun, and even that one is going to wind up getting a little more work. Currently, I'm working on the novelization of that one, which I'll probably put out as an ebook or something like that. Um, so you guys can start downloading it and start reading it if you'd like, and you know, start spreading the word around if you like it. That kind of thing. Don't get me singing. What? Don't get me singing. Singing? What were you gonna say? Start. Start. No, 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 no. But we would like to spread the news of the DVD. The DVD? Okay. Um, the Undead Cow Studio Collection, Volume One is up on the website. Uh, it is a free download for anybody who knows how to burn a disc image. So you can download a copy. It's got the artwork included in the DVD ROM portion. Uh, so you can print out the artwork, make a cover and all that if you would like. Uh, all completely free. And if you just want to check it out and you don't actually want to download it or anything like that, it is on the website as a flash version. Okay, so the whole DVD is on the website. And you could watch it just like you were watching it on your television using your mouse instead of your remote control and watch the whole thing on the website. So that's kind of cool. Pass the word around about that. Uh, a lot of good stuff there. A lot of uh, good stuff. <laughs> yeah. um, Special features, commentaries. <clears throat> the website itself is undergoing another overhaul and parts of it are looking crappy. It's all functioning, but you know, some parts of it. have to get to that, but, uh, oh, oh, yeah, um, one of the new pages, well, I've added a download page for the DVDs, and there's going to be free stuff, and, you know, anything else I can put up there, just to, you know, just to give back some, uh, but there's also going to be a project page, which is probably really stupid of me to do, I know nobody else is doing anything like this, but as I, yeah, usually, usually. Uh, as I am working on a particular project or anything like that, I want to put the script up there. I want to put the storyboards up there. I want to put up any kind of materials I may have up until that point for it. So like if I find little test pieces for the special effect or anything like that, I want to put that up there. Oh, the special effect. You should be seeing this in a special effect. I hope so. Don't know if that's really going to happen at this point, 
but hopefully you're seeing like kind of a snowy image or something like that. I said, it. what do you mean I'm going to be in it? I've been taking a shower. Yeah, we... Yeah. It's been one of those days. It's been one of those days. Smokes is in the can, except for some additional shots I need for the special effects and things like that. Uh, Sheila's Demise is in the can, but Sheila's Demise is, uh, except for the actors, is going to be completely CG, kind of like... You know, Sky Captain of Tomorrow or 300 or something like that. You know, so that's going to be a long time before that winds up coming out, actually, because it's going to spend a lot of time in post. But the shoot was awesome. The shoot was totally awesome. Got some great shots. Yeah. yeah. Great yeah. acting. Really, really nice acting. Beat, we're going to start shooting tomorrow. Uh, Beat is going to be a long shoot, though. Know, it's, it's all small little vignettes. It's a real artsy farty piece. But then each one of those little vignettes is going to be a different location, hopefully. You know, so this will all be in the graveyard. Then Tim we're, is. We're going to the cemetery tomorrow. I'm excited. Beautiful cemetery. Tim Gravelin of um, Urban Yeti uh, is, which there'll be a link on my site soon uh, for his website. He's going to get us a, he knows of a location where they have all these trolley cars and old train cars and things like that. And hopefully get that together for the next... Sunday seems to be good for everybody, so maybe we'll just stick with Sunday. Sunday. Um, and see if we can get in there for next week and shoot a couple more scenes. And then the whole thing is five to seven pages someplace. The full script, I think. So it's going to be a lot of a lot of different locations and shot in very small bits. Uh, so it's all eventually done. And then he does his <laughs> uh, Jeff Lee, who um, ran the camera on ran one of the cameras on Shields to My uh, no, not Shields to My Sweet Slasher and uh, Morning Person. He is going to be helping out shooting beat with his DSLR camera. And this one, because it's an art piece, everybody is going to just be... I want to see what everybody else is going to bring to the table. You know, I've written a script, I have ideas in mind for what I want to do about the locations and the actors and all that kind of stuff. And I do have it in my head for what I want the actors to do, but I really want to see what the actors do first and see if they come up with something better, more organic, and more interesting than what I might have in my head. And that's really the same thing with Jeff. Like, each of the little vignettes I have all penciled out, different effects that I would do and stuff like this. Uh, but I want to see what Jeff does with the camera and just see. give him that freedom yeah. and find out what happens there. So, um, somewhere around Christmas Eve time, after the last State of the Cow, um, I was told by somebody else, actually I was told by Nick from Via Entertainment, a uh, talent agency in this area, that uh, there was somebody interested in me to direct a feature film for them. And after a lot of phone tag and things like that, uh, we finally wound up getting together. At first it was going to be a Christian anti-pornography movie and now it's totally up in the air as to what it's actually going to be. Uh, but we had a long sit down and we talked about it and it's like, okay, let's, let's go do this. Um, he says he can get it funded, so, you know, let's do it. We might actually have some money to do something. Oh, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, we're going to be doing another video of Viscosity very soon. Uh, probably next Saturday, maybe. Um, and... In the last episode of Video Viscosity, you might have noticed a new opening, but Liz Day, who did sound for Sweet Slasher, uh, has done an opening theme for that for that opening, and it's really cool. Uh, her link should be down here. Uh, Urban Yeti should be down here too, right? Okay. Yeah, I have to look at that. All right. Yeah. That's put it right, that's put it right, like right there. Put it right on top of this? Yeah. Okay. Or right next to. Right is it going to be a ticker tape? Okay. Maybe it'll just go right over our faces. 
Manitou, still working at Manitou on the still documentary. Still working on Manitou, yes. Uh, got a lot of footage, got to get a lot more footage. Yeah. Uh, and unfortunately, just have to try to squeeze that in with everything else that's going on. But we will. the Manitou Project, I've met with a lot of people there. Actually, I didn't even say anything about the Manitou Project. For real, you know, I just mentioned that one time that I wanted to do it. We're doing it. Well, that's about it. Uh, hope to get another State of the Cow ups up again soon, but look forward to new content every Thursday. Okay? See ya.